Welcome to part three of our time in Amsterdam. This is the first country of our tour of the world where we're going to go to 12 countries in 12 months this year. And we're starting off in this little duck shop in Amsterdam. Look at all the ducks, man. We've got ourselves a duck. Do you want to show everyone your duck? Can you see it? Spider-Man duck. Couldn't be fair. No, they couldn't be, but good though. We just had to pay for it. We gave them the money. 13 euros for a rubber duck, but we gave them it. And then you still want some chippies at some point, don't you? We're back now in the Grand Square, which is where we kind of started off. So I'm going to go find somewhere to wander from here. Oh, that duck. It's cute. Cute duck. Oh, that's good. So we've just made a stop in the train station to change your bum because he's falling asleep and my arm's walking here. And I turn down and look at him. Not even woken up to his bum changed. Bless him. So we're gonna get him back on my shoulder and keep wandering, see so what else we can find. The cube toes was all massive, so we've still not got in there. What's the next thing we wanna go look for? Uh, we want some chips at some point. I want some street waffles. I'm just gonna see what else we can find. Oh yeah, there's a massive sweet shop as well, so we'll show you that. Just take a pause for a moment, because we just was wandering out and then we saw these people fishing. You think? that would not be allowed in where we live. But when we were walking up, we were saying, weren't we, this city is just built on transport. Oh, it's raining again. But yeah, absolutely incredible. Super cool. Wow. We have ended up in McDonald's just for something to sit down. There's nowhere, because it's all wet outside, there's nowhere to sit. So at least here we've got a seat, we've got a couple of chips and a couple of nugs to help us have half an hour in here. You have finally woken up, haven't you? Say hi. Still a tad grumpy from waking up. Yeah, there you go. Good example right there. So we're just going to sit, chill out for half an hour and then go find somewhere else. What's, what's it, what are you saying? It's raining. It is raining, isn't it? It's still. No way. No way. Oh, sorry, I flipped on set. We'll flip back again. Here we all are. Yeah. It's still raining. You're still in my arms. Then they'll be carrying you around all day. I got you. Oh, I know, it's a bit wet, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, trying to go find some we've not explored yet. Who's it? It's Spider Duck. It's Spider Duck. Tell them all about it. Yeah. Um, we've made it to a pancake house. This place, to be exact. Which is a throwback to me and Rachel's first ever date. When we were at first year at Union Hall, we went to Dutch Pancake House, which wasn't there for a long time, really, like a year maybe. Mm -hmm. So we never ever had another pancake at a place. So this is a throwback. You trying to get your drink out? Yes. You got it? Good boy. So we, me and Laura showing a lemon and sugar one. Rachel's got a plain one because you're a weird and like your pancakes plain. You getting your tags? Yeah. You got coffee? And I've got a coffee down there. I'll right, spin you around. Rachel has got a cup of tea. No, not a cup of tea, a cup of coffee. A glass of coffee. <laughs> Rachel's got some coke, haven't you? Yeah. You're putting it on the side. We've, we're all getting a bit tired. It's now our bus back to the boat is at five o'clock, and it's now just gone three. And I reckon it's it'll be pretty started raining again, huh? I reckon by the time we finish here, it'll be nearly perfect yeah. timing. But none of it. There's no bins. You've got to stay in this bit. Okay. okay. If you want to put them in a bin, put them in this bit. Store them in there, in that pocket. Yeah. 
We could always go. We can go to a little souvenir shop after. Yeah, know. I want some souvenirs, but I think we're going to aim. The bus stop is about half an hour's walk from here. Aim out there for just gone half four. Twenty minutes to the round waiting is not too bad. Make sure we get on the bus. Thank you. But yeah, show you food when it comes. Yes. And Noah is having a wonderful little time in his little corner. You got your tags from your duck. Where's your duck gone? Here. Spider duck. Spider duck. That's all right. There's our pancake. We've got syrup. We got sugar. We got lemon. They gave us real lemon to squeeze onto it. Squeeze the lemon on. Oh yeah, we're good. That's the pancake shop where we just had some pancakes. We've just been to find a toilet. It's a very, very nice hotel in the main square that we've been in twice now and asked to change the nappy and use the toilet. Very lovely people. Definitely want to stay there again one day because I do want to come back. Yeah, Mummy did too. Oh, it's a busy place. It's a busy capital city. But I'm sorry, I'm pretty sure it is, yeah. You did, didn't you? But yeah, this hotel is definitely one I don't think we're going to afford to go in. Type of when you walk in just oozes expense. People there to take baggage and welcome drinks on the side. You have been to the toilet, yes. So now we are walking back to the bus. We've got just under an hour till the bus leaves. And it's about a 20 minute walk down in that direction roughly. Yeah, I think we've got to go under this bridge and then walk the other side of this building. So it'll be perfect timing. Yeah. And we are almost back onto the boat. It was just over an hour again, hour and 15, I think, back to the port through security, which is so much easier than at an airport. It was busy today because everyone's getting back, but 15 minute queue. And then now we are down here. This is the gangway back to the boat, isn't it? We're going to go find our room. We are all cream crackered it has been a busy busy day you want to come up oh. yeah mine that's okay look down here here it is why is it cold yeah i'm gonna go get on go find our room and i think we're all gonna have a bit of a not an early night but Hopefully a good night's sleep is the plan, isn't it? Yeah, there's still people with loads of people queuing to get on, so oh, we'll hello. see. So they just made an announcement on the tannoy saying there was availability to upgrade your room. So I went and checked and we could. So we need to pack up our room and go find our fancy club room because we've got upgrades. So a club room. Oh, so. Don't know what's in it apart from there's a double bed and a TV, which is a win. So we're going to pack up and go find our new room and we'll show you when we get there. And here we go, this is the club room. Oh, that bed's right. comfy, oh comfy big bed. We've also got two beds up there, not that we're going to need them. No, it's got to go down here. But it's space. We've got a full selection of teas, coffees and cookies. There's also in there, which I'm not... Oh, I'm gonna open it. That is a dryer. Go see mummy. There's a free mini fridge. With all gorgeous stuff inside. By that I mean Pepsi, Diet Pepsi, wine, Heineken, and water. Oh, I'm happy. Oh, we got dressing gowns. Oh, I'm sorry, we got a dressing gown on. Happy oh, days. Got a big mirror. Got a TV at the end of the bed. And we've also got a window that looks out. I think this is the back of the boat, though it might be the front of the boat. One of the two ways on the boat. Right out there. And a nice little picture on the wall. So yeah, if you're looking at upgrade, this is what you get. We went out in a little tiny room that you can see earlier in the video. The little tiny room we went out. Oh, and this is the bathroom. It's very similar, isn't it? This is, yeah, this is pretty much exactly the same. Woo! We did good. I am happy with that. Now we just need to unpack the barbics again. Got the food, let's go back to the room. There's a selection on top. We've got the wedges and the dips and the garlic bread. And underneath, we've got, let's just scoot those bits away. Oh, that looks quite nice, that. It's all right, that, isn't it? £22. It's going to feed all three of us a small tea. 
as the price of you sure. Good morning. We have woken up from our sleep. We all had a pretty good sleep in here. No, it's happy running around at the minute, up and down. Um, but yeah, it was a good sleep. We had a nice time. Food was amazing last night. We are, it really was. We are just literally, we can see out the windows there, like the port and everything. We're just about there. It's very, was it six o'clock the time I came on saying good morning everyone we're about an hour away and that is the one thing I hate about this <laughs> I mean, you have to parents that have got kids that can't handle that I know because it's easy alright to be fair but that's yeah. I can't handle that like he, he was grumpy when he woke because that woke him up and he was then grumpy for about 20 minutes not crying but just like not knowing where he was not wanting to do anything but wanting to do stuff and yeah but it's now 20 to 7, so we've got 20 minutes ish to we get there. So we're going to start tidying up, packing up. Can you hear people moving around? Yeah. They can probably hear you as well. Hey, look at you. How are you? There you are. You got your plug? You're having fun with it? Yeah. Oh, good. And then we'll be getting off, getting in the car, and going home. And here we are. We're all packed up, aren't we? Ready to go. There's the room looking nice and clean. And we all finally, we're just about boarding or docking, I think. It's just about seven o'clock. So we're going to sit for a couple of minutes and then go. Because yesterday we were sat waiting for like 50 minutes by the door. I think we did on the tunnel yesterday as well. It was like seven cars and lorries first. And then oh, 10 minutes yeah. later we put passengers. So we've probably got a few minutes before we can actually get we're off We're going to be anyway. in a queue regardless. Yeah, so we'll chill out in here and then we'll get going and see how long it takes to get back to the car and ready to get going home. It's safe to say this was the perfect start to our tour of the world we're doing this year where we we're going to visit 12 countries in the next 12 months and we absolutely loved it. This was just a little clip of us at home getting unpacked, sorting things out. Unfortunately, the sound didn't really work. So I just like to say thank you to you guys now for watching this video. Hopefully you've enjoyed it and as always, please comment, like, subscribe to the channel and we're going to go to so many places over the next 12 months and beyond. Oh, and that is where we're going to leave today's video. Thank you very much if you came along with us. And there'll be lots more to come. That is country one of hopefully 12 this year. We're aiming for 